Hello people, how you all doing this morning? Uh, I just wanted to make a quick video just to address some of the comments in the last video. And I've had a bit of backlash for it, like, um, a lot of people don't like it and I've had more thumbs down than thumbs up ratio, so I must be hitting someone's nerves. But one of the comments was, well, when Jewish people get their ancestry done, why does it come back Jewish? Well, people, let me blow your mind here. There isn't one gene that can determine your race. There isn't one genetic marker to determine your race. Get that? So these companies like Ancestry.com and they're, they've got access to all your records military, birth certificates, death certificates, church. Um, they've got access to all your records and your parents' records and your grandparents, probably took since records began. If, you've, if you paid a few membership on Ancestry.com, you get access to all the records. And I think that's all Ancestry do, really, to build up a ethnicity of you, is uh, they just go through all your records, your family's records go down each person's line to find if there's any foreigners, any, and then they determine what ethnicity you are. But I'll say it again. There isn't one gene that can determine what race you are. Think about that. Cheers, guys.